Hello everyone, my name is Garrick. I'm here today really excited. I get to react to a brand new Agonist song just came out. I absolutely love their last song in Vertigo. Um, haven't been following them very much since um, Vicky joined the group a few years back when Alyssa went to Arch Enemy. I was a really big fan of them back in the day, um, back in the end of, towards the end of high school, around that time. Um, yeah, I'm really excited to see what these guys have to offer. Um, it's my first reaction video. Um, I was going to do a more introduction with my equipment a little bit more before I did one of these, but I really want to watch this video and I really want to do a reaction to it. So without further ado, this is Burn It All Down by The Agonist. Super excited for this. Hi, Vicky. Hopefully she does some low growls like she did in Vertigo. Burn it all down. Okay. Oh yeah. Yep. Okay. All right. So starting off, um, like the introduction, um, she has already two different styles of vocals. Um, she's really improved her vocals since um, some of her. I think the first two albums they had came out. Uh, I can't remember the names of them now. One of them was called Five. Um, I liked them, but it wasn't really quite what I remember from the Agonist of old. Um, so I was, I kind of gave Nick, Vicky a really hard rap. Um, I was comparing her to Alyssa White Blues, who was really, really talented. And then until recently, I kind of just wrote Nick Vicky off. Um, but now I'm really excited for this album coming out in September. Let's continue. Love the musicianship of this band too. Very talented. Okay. Hell yeah. Very high fry screen. Very beautiful queens. Alright, so she's doing more clean vocals than she did in Vertigo. Um, this is a little bit more like I expected from this band. Um, they haven't been very heavy recently uh, until in Vertigo came out. So this is a little bit more mixed. She does a lot of clean and a lot of fry screaming. Um, I like a good mix though, so that's really good. I like Vicky's cleans a lot. Um, her fry scream's also very good. She does a low growl. I'm hoping she does it later on in the song, but let's find out. I can fire behind her, but that's really cool. Good drum work. That's cool. Hell yeah. Oh yeah. Okay, what's this? Burn it 
Okay, that was a different different bit right there. Um, I don't know how I felt about that. I mean, it sounds pretty good all over, overall together, but I don't know. that a lot all right that was burn it all down by the agonist featuring vicky on vocals i like that a lot it's really good um it's a little bit different than in vertigo the last song they put out um they've got a new album coming out in september i'm really looking forward to it i'm hoping they got a good mix of it um if we get a lot of songs like in vertigo with like a very heavy heavy metal and more of this melodic sound i really like that sound um i'll definitely be buying this album very excited for it um overall yeah, it's a good song. As you can see, I'm rocking Arch Enemy. I'm a big fan of Alyssa White Glues, um, the previous singer for The Agonist. Uh, I really owe Vicky an apology. I didn't give her really enough time to really grow on me. Um, I watched a few of their videos they put out after Alyssa left, and I really didn't care for them that much. And I kind of just forgot about The Agonist until recently when they came back into the fold with this new album they're working on. I'm um, really excited for it. Yeah, it's really good. Um, she did a lot of clean vocals in this time around, which is nice. I think she has a very, very nice clean vocal. I mean, she really kind of focused on that in the previous two albums, which wasn't bad at all. It just if you wasn't what I wanted from the Agonist. I like that really that contrast, that fry scream, um, that pretty deep vocal. She does a fantastic deep vocal. Um, it sounds like it's a false chord. I don't know for sure though. Um, I don't think she's said, but it sounds really good. I was kind of hoping she'd do it in this song, but she didn't. That's okay. Um, she did some great queens, some some great high fries. Um, visuals were fantastic. I always loved the visual of fire. Kind of remind me of a little bit of Psychosocial. Slipknot. Um, the band's always fantastic behind her as well. Um, the guitarist has always been one of my favorites. He always writes some very nice riffs. Um, drummer's solid too. Um, bass player's really good. Um, the, didn't really showcase him very much this time around, but he was definitely doing a lot of work in the background there. Yeah, um, this video may not be the highest quality that I want it to be. Um, like I said, I was kind of hoping to set some more things up and get everything kind of more situated before I started recording videos. Um, I have a certain quality standard I kind of want to adhere to, but I saw this one pop up and I couldn't help myself. I had to watch it and I wanted to be recording to it with their actual reaction. So I did this instead. So if it's not the highest quality, I apologize. My future content, I really hope it will be a higher quality. On um, this camera is also only temporary, possibly. If this if this channel takes off at all, I'll definitely invest in a higher quality camera. For now, I'm just using this webcam. Um, I've done a little bit of research into cameras and sound equipment. Um, I'm really new to this. I don't know much about it, but it's something I really want to get into. Um, so yeah, if you like my channel, go ahead and subscribe. I'm going to be doing a lot of... Um, reviews of bands, songs, um, games, videos, TV shows, um, a lot of stuff like that. I um, really just want to kind of share my enthusiasm with just the stuff I love. Um, if I get one subscriber, great. If I get 100 subscribers, also great. Um, I'm doing this for myself. Um, I gotta not say, um, yeah. But thank you so much for watching. Um, remember to be kind to each other. We're all struggling out here.